What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 21 video. It is 6pm on Wednesday. We should have a brand new team of the week, a brand new Silver Stars. Um, we should have hopefully some new uh, some new other style of content. The Silver Stars isn't there yet. And um, we should have maybe some uh, showdown cards for the Champions League final and possibly some other SBCs in there today. So what have we got? Oh my God, they actually gave... Oh wow, that is that. That is two very, very, very good cards. Kyle Walker, showdown card. High, high work rate, six foot tall. Now he is only... Well, he's not only... He is a right back, not a centre back. Um, but let's assume he doesn't get the plus two upgrade. It doesn't matter. That is a brilliant card. Um... Obviously, with an anchor chem style, he'll go 98 acceleration, 99 sprint speed, top tier defending, top tier physicals. He's got good dribbling, um, and he's he's just a beast, isn't he? Anyway, six foot tall with it. Um, and then if he does get the plus two upgrade, 95 acceleration, 99 sprint speed on the base pace, you wouldn't even need to improve that anymore. And uh, a bigger boost in some uh, some other stats as well. That's that's quality. Um, I have a feeling a lot of people are going to want him. And do you know what? He's not even that expensive. An 83, an 84, and an 86 with Team of the Seasons. Low chemistry on them all. Um, so that's not too bad. And then a Timo Werner as well. Four-star, four-star, 5'11", high medium. It's a good card. It's just a good card. It's not a great card. It kind of needs the upgrade. Um, you know, you, he could certainly do with a bit more strength and aggression. He could certainly do with a little boost in dribbling after a chem style applied. Um, and then a little boost in shooting would be quite nice as well. But yeah, if Chelsea win and Werner goes up to a 93, this card will be cracked. If Chelsea don't win, this card is just good, in my opinion. I, I think there's already like better slash as good as cards out there. He's an 83, an 85, and an 86. It's actually, wow. So for, for EA to price Werner more expensive than Walker is surprising. An 83, an 85, and an 86 for him. An 83, an 84, and an 86 for him. So in EA's books, Werner is the more overpowered slash broken card in the game. Um, and that that's surprising. That is surprising. What else have we got here today? We have got... That might be it for today. 84 plus rare player pick. And a Serie A team of the season guaranteed. Oh, so no other guaranteed there. So there's a couple of a couple of like guaranteed content there. Um, and then let's have a look at the team of the week for this week and see what we're playing with. Let's see what EA have given. If it's it's a high rated squad. Okay, so they gave a hero Suarez, which is quite nice. Of course, largely pointless because A, he already has an objective card that was as good as this, and B, he has a team of the season card. But either way, three star, four star as well, not the four star, four star. Nice card, nice physicals, nice dribbling. Reasonable passing, good shooting, just not the greatest in pace. Um, we got an inform Mane. He already, of course, has a better card in the game as well, but that would be a good card to pack. He'll be worth a whole bunch. We got an inform Serge Nabry. Um, yeah, reasonable stats for an 88 rated card. Stindle in there as well. Luka Modric as an 88. And inform Pepe. And I tell you what I like about the fact that we got an inform Pepe here. Is now, if he gets player of the month, I don't know if he will, it will go up to an 89, which is real nice. And this Pepe card, four star skill moves. I mean, it is it is a reasonably well rounded card for an 87. Low aggression, low composure, otherwise not awful. The right chem style could be very good for him. And then the if if a player of the month could be nice. Um we've also got a Victor Ruiz too slow, a Maripan too slow. And a Kayer, too slow. Is he lessening goal? No one cares about goalkeepers. Same for him. Same for him. This guy we don't really care about. Pablo Fornals doesn't look very good. Vanekin we don't care about. We've got a Hero David card. I wonder if that boosts his uh, one to watch, does it? Five-star weak foot, three-star skill moves on him. Again, super low aggression. He had so much potential, didn't he, at the start of the year to, to end up being a monster card. We've got an Adeyemi gold in form. Uh, he obviously has a silver stars, but that's quite an interesting one. Um, we got a green hero card and a boy hero card there, and a Kelly silver in form. There's some decent players in team of the week, to be fair. Um, there's some decent players in there, and then let's have a look at the objectives for today. See if EA have updated that for today. 
There is a new Silver Stars. It's a left wing Larson. I mean, real good dribbling. He's, I mean, he's got a reasonable card for a Silver. I just don't know how you're going to link him to uh, the other Silver Stars. We've got Silver Beast there as well again. And nothing else new in that regard and nothing else new in that regard. Um, so, what have we got? We've got some dupes here. Quadrado twice, Romero, Chiellini. I'll, I'll do the 84 plus player pick. Um, or this. It, was it a Serie A player pick or just a player pick? Got a, yeah, an 84 plus rare player pick. We'll do this one for this video. I'm going to save the guaranteed for... Um, I'm going to save the guaranteed for the first owner ultimate team video let's pop quadrado in and then this was only an 83 rated squad so this is actually good stuff right we could pop in some 83s and uh, we'll also be able to pop in a whole bunch of 82s in here as well because already this is just too high rated yeah some of the 81s and 82s we can get rid of as well which is quite nice uh we'll have a look i don't know if zagadu would have been upgraded straight away ea typically don't <laughs> Um, you know, straight away. So, wow, this is an 84 still. My word. There we go. Now we're down to an 83. An 82 in there. Another 82 in there. Still 83. Can I get another 81 or 82 in there? Um, but yeah, it's uh, what's sad as well is because they do the upgrades for cards um, after Wednesdays, the Fred or... Paco Alcacer cards that are available right now, they will only get upgraded after next Wednesday because the game is being played tonight, obviously. How sad is that? Okay, that, that's where we're at with that. 91 rated, a few 83s for an 84 plus rated player pick. We obviously want to see some team of the seasons out of this. Would be uh, very nice. I'm going to hook us up, baby. No. Wow. Wow. That's bad. We get one Fabinho. That's, that's just not very good. And then, let's go and have a look, guys, at these showdown cards and see what we can do for some in-games. How well these are going to be. Have a look at this, uh, this, this other new guy. Where is he? We've got Walker. We've got Werner. The Silver Stars isn't there yet, unfortunately. What was the Silver Stars game, the guy's name? I can't remember. And then Zagadu doesn't look to be... Um, hasn't been upgraded yet. When he gets upgraded, whew, my word. So, Carl Walker, guys. Three-star, two-star. Compared to his most recent 86, they've given him three pace. Wow, they have given him a big boost in agility and balance. And then a reasonable boost across the board elsewhere. An anchor is just good enough, isn't it? Sentinel's not bad. Do you know what? Sentinel's very good. Very good. Um... It depends on what you want, really. I think a Sentinel is probably the best. 97 sprint speed, 93 acceleration is already super. Getting that defending and physical right up there. I, I think that's, like, with how good that dribbling is in general, he, he's just very, very good, isn't he? He's just very good. And he's very reasonably priced. For me, the surprise is Werner. Now, have they upgraded his weak four skill moves? Yeah, so they gave him an extra skill move. So he's 4-4 now on this one, which is very nice. Makes him so much more usable. Um... They've given him 11 stamina, 10 short passing, which is very nice. And in general, again, this card is good. An engine chem style might be the one for him just to get that agility and balance right up there. Passing very good. Shooting's already good outside of long shots. And so, may, I mean, maybe a Hawk. Great pace, very good physicals, great finishing, good short passing. Just a little heavy on the dribbling. He kind of, like, for me personally, with how I know this game plays and how I feel like these kind of players play in-game, I feel like he needs the upgrade, whereas I don't feel like Walker needs the upgrade. Um, however, I also am surprised that Verno is more expensive than Walker. Um, that is very surprising. And then we've got the 84-plus player pick and the guaranteed Serie A team, like, massively downvoted. As I said, guys, I don't think we're going to do share plays today because I just don't really... like. They're just not good, are they? Um, they're just not good. Your voice is so annoying. Well, thanks for being in the stream, Jack Pal. Um, but that's where we're at for today, guys. So uh, we'll wait for the Zagadu upgrade. We'll wait for maybe the David one to watch upgrade and a few other upgrades. But that is where we're at for the content today. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, rate, and comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, I'm out.
Peace.